All right, let's do a quick over, or overview of the boat. Um, a 13 foot trailer boat, uh, one of the two years uh, that they made fiberglass boats. That's, uh, this one is a 1959. Um, again, the top is kind of epoxied, somewhat rough uh, to preserve the finish, uh, still yet to be sanded down and repainted. Uh, the interior here is uh, pretty much finished. Uh, so, we've got some side consoles, uh, with cabinets, a little uh, bins for knickknacks and whatnot, uh, a couple of downriggers. Uh, control panel which has integrated controls for electrical motor which is not currently uh, installed I took it off because I will not be needing it this weekend um, so did some uh, wiring updates and controls for the new motor we'll get to it uh, in a second here um, so I got a solar panel here that's uh, hinged to the top and it will swing uh, with the top and can end up uh, on the roof out of the way when the top is up um, this charges the 12 volt system which is used for starting the motor obviously and uh, to run um, both peripherals like the music uh, gauges and uh, lighting that kind of stuff and the fish finder all right uh, so uh, everything else is more or less uh, the same as it was the last time around um, let's get over to the motor that's the new uh, addition to the boat this is a uh, 1959 um so i made a mistake the boat is 57 the, mo the motor is uh 59 uh super seahorse uh jump by johnson 35 hp uh kind of fully rebuilt regasketed resealed um and uh freshened up uh this time it has actually has electrical start which should make uh this boat quite a bit easier to operate um with the steering included uh, that came with the motor. Kind of reused parts of the steering rack there. Uh, used the cable I already had and the steering head that I already had uh, and just kind of changed the rack. Uh, so now it's kind of cleaner and more out of the way. Um, so I think it's time to, uh, to go ahead and uh, start it up and kind of give it its first uh, completed run. Now the motor has run before, of course, but now with all the wiring completed, uh, it can also should uh, be able to be started from the dashboard now. So let's get over to the dashboard here. All right, so we have electric choke. And, and the key starting. I'm gonna kind of bring up the throttle a little bit. All right, uh, we're in neutral here. Let's go ahead and give it a shot. Uh, keep the choke on for a second. And now without a choke. I'm going to warm up just a bit. Get a little more throttle.